Welcome to the iPad Apps Rislik channel and this is a interesting app if you are really going crazy with the battery uh, discharging too fast and you wonder what the hell is happening with my iPhone or iPad. Well Battery Doctor, Master of Battery by Beijing Kingsoft uh, Internet whatever <laughs> and it's a um, nice app to give you interesting details about the usage of your phone and iPad and iPod Touch. Uh, 23.7 megabyte download, it's a totally free app. It requires iOS 5 or later, so it works with older devices. Compatible with iPhone, iPad and iPod Touch. Optimized for an iPhone 5 and it has a few um, languages available. Uh, no in-app purchases, it's really a free app. But there's a, a a thing that makes it free is the fact that it also has you know like app suggestions that you can download and buy so they uh, pay themselves with ads basically once you've installed it you get that little battery uh, icon and actually first of all if of course it's gonna ask you to send notifications it's gonna ask you to uh, you know get your location and so on because it has weather and all sorts of little things so uh, you know, if you want to customize it, of course, you're telling it to uh, get your location will, of course, make all of that work better. Um, so here's the uh, first detail that you get is that uh, nice little blue line at the top that says, uh, you know, how many, how much power left remaining in hours? How many hours? Typically, you'll have depending on what you use, and if you're using apps, it's gonna, you know, really change. Uh, then you have the memory used, so you can go and check and it says, okay, 71% of the memory is used. You can boost if you want, which removes, you know, uh, unwanted stuff, things that aren't necessary while you're using your uh, phone or iPad. And so um, typically, you know, should make it faster. You can check for junk files. A lot of apps actually have junk files that they put in the memory or in the uh, internal memory of your device. You can clean up cache. Uh, you also have, um, you know, the uh, optimize. You can click optimize, which will tell you uh, things that you can do to actually extend your battery life. So it's going to say, well, disable Wi-Fi or disable GPS or lower the brightness, uh, turn on ne off network and so on which will give you, and it gives you a, an approximate time that it gives you if you disable these things. So, you know, as to increase. Uh, power usage details is interesting because it's going to let you know which application use the most power when you use them. So, uh, it's going to tell you, um, you know, by giving you like a level of each app and how much power it uses in your iPhone or iPad. So it gives you an idea of which apps are really power hungry, which apps are you using that are actually really taking a lot of power, and which apps are actually taking the least power. So you have an idea of what apps you might avoid, for example, if you're low on battery, and what apps um, are okay to use. So uh, you have um, the charging records. Now, if you leave the um, app running all the time, it's going to give you, you know, uh, when you had full cycles, when you uh, partially uh, had partial cycles or overcharged maybe your iPhone, all sorts of little things like that. Uh, and you have the remaining that's going to tell you, okay, here's uh, power usage details, internet on Wi-Fi, internet on 3G, talk time, so on all sorts of little details of what you're doing actually with your uh, you know iOS device so it's a very nice app for that because it has a lot, of, a lot of details on what you're doing uh, it has you know the charge information the health score of uh, how you are charging and actually that's interesting because it has a health score uh, you know people often either overcharge or not charge enough their phone and so by having a score, a health score, gives you an idea of uh, you know, how well you are actually charging your battery so that uh, it's going to prolong basically the battery life of your device. 
uh, you know if you discharge every day all the time it's not good like if it's always plugged in it's not good either so uh, you have to be somewhere in the middle and I'm obviously a lot in the middle because I usually charge uh, you know relatively often and uh, thanks to the fact that I have a battery case but uh, it, you know it's interesting data and I think this app is cool for that it gives you lots of information uh, gives you you know memory information um, device optimal device you can scan uh, you can check for junk files and so on and uh, that's where the app probably pays for itself because it has a market which is where you can uh, get apps actually it's gonna you know give you free apps and uh, give you information of uh, the latest apps what's trending and you, know, you see at the top hot now swing copters so it's it's giving you details so that's how the app pays itself actually because it's uh, you know it has this little app store basically inside the app for all sorts of apps that might want to uh, show up there so uh, all in all nice uh, little battery app uh, battery doctor uh, go and get it I think if you have battery problems uh, this is a cool app to use to uh, maybe optimize and learn a little more on what's actually making your iPhone uh, you know power down so fast uh, great great app battery doctor free of charge in the uh, the app store for iOS if you have any comments questions on what you've seen let us know maybe you have an app that you'd like us to talk about let us know maybe you uh, have a feature something about uh, you know iOS that you'd like us to make a video of we can do that and of course by subscribing to our channel you'll be informed when new videos are online so thank you for watching and hope to see you again on the iPad Apps for Slick channel. Bye-bye.